Here's how I start off my Mississippi pot roast. I put my roast in my Instapot. I put salt and pepper on them. And I already got that. So I'm fixing to get the soup, Lipton soup mix in the packets. And I'm gonna put probably two in this because I have two roasts in here. So I use the generic brand. It's just as good. And it's in the packets like this. So this is the onion soup mix on top of it that I've sprinkled all in it and everything. And I'm fixing to add two tablespoons of ranch. So I had to use about three and a half tablespoons of ranch because I have two roasts in here. And I've done one and a half uh, packs of um, onion soup mix. And then I'm gonna put a half a stick of margarine in there and some pepperoncini peppers. Did y'all see them? Okay, so I've got my margarine in here right there that y'all see. And I have some juice from the pepperoncini peppers. And I have about probably 13 or 14 in here since it's two roast. Right there it is. So now I'm gonna put on the lid to my Instapot. Let me get it on there. I'm gonna lock it right here and I'm gonna put it on pressure. I'm gonna go to pressure cook. I didn't, um, I didn't sear mine, so I didn't want them seared. So even though it locks in the flavor, this makes it just a little bit more um, softer to me. So I put it on hour and 20 minutes. It's um, building up pressure now. And it'll go round and round until it gets the pressure built up. And then it'll cook for an hour and 20 minutes because they were a little bit frozen still. And see so pressure. So that. And so make sure it's on there good. And when it gets done, I'll bring y'all back and let you see. Okay? So we'll do then. some carrots in the roast after it gets done and I'll let off the steam. I'm gonna do green beans and homemade mashed potatoes. So here's my Mississippi pot roast afterwards. So it got done and then afterwards I added carrots in it. Put it back on in my um, Instapot for 30 minutes more. And y'all, I love my Instapot. It makes things so simple. I'm at, you can just get things done, throw it in the pot and forget about it and let it do its job. So that's the way that looks. Then let's say I made, I just made these and put them in the refrigerator. So then I made deviled eggs, of course, and uh, cooked some rice to go with it. The rice looks funny being up against this counter like this. Look at it. But there it is. I made a bowl of rice, and then Tara put on the green beans for me. So we're having rice, meat. Green beans, deviled eggs. I didn't make the macaroni and cheese today because I just didn't feel like it. So, everyone stay blessed. Have a blessed day. God bless you all. I love you all. And I'll see you later. Okay? Bye, y'all.